We've been invited out here by the Polish uh, 4th Seaburn Battalion to train and integrate with them on decontamination procedures. So we brought out five Bradleys, about 30 guys to come out here and do the training, along with a uh, batch of medics about a platoon to come out here and practice the medical Seaburn decontamination process. Well, training Seaburn is important because one of those capabilities that we don't always have access to at home is one of those critical training opportunities where in the Seaburn environment for either nuclear or chemical, um, training the decontamination process with our full-up uh, protective suits, the JS list, using our pro masks, getting the opportunity to integrate with a foreign country and see how they do it is a chance for us to learn and teach and it also integrates so that we all become a little bit better and a little bit more proficient. We had a platoon of medics from our headquarters troop come out. Uh, their opportunity here was to see how contaminated soldiers go through the decontamination process from point of injury to point of healthcare. So they're able to go through, see an injury or a casualty that was in their full JS list suit, be received by the Polish military, go through the initial decontamination process, downloading their gear, going through their tent where they had essentially a roller system. They were able to use a spine board, integrate with the uh, Polish, take them, treat the casualty, move it through the spine board on the rollers, and then be able to do the uh, medical treatment on the back end.